This example shows you how to get started with grid gain. Before we start the example, we need to make sure that we have a few grid nodes started. I will be starting grid nodes directly from my local laptop. From my grid gains home bin directory, I'll run gg start and specify an example configuration file from my grid gain installation. We have got one node started. Let's start another node by running gg start again. Note that the nodes have automatically discovered each other and we now have two nodes running. Let's start our favorite IDE. Here, I already have a Maven project with a grid gain dependency specified in the palm. Let's create a new class. I'm going to name it Hello World. We'll be creating a simple example which will broadcast a runnable to all the other grid nodes and print out Hello World. First, we get an instance of grid by starting a local node here and we specify the same example configuration file that we had specified when we started our remote nodes. Then we use broadcast method on grid compute API to send our grid runnable instance to all the nodes in the grid. Here, I'll simply print hello world. Since the broadcast method returns a future, we must call get to wait for it to complete on all the nodes. Let's save and execute. On our local node, we see hello world. Let's check our remote nodes. As expected, we do see hello world printed on all the nodes. GridGain also allows you to select only a subgroup of nodes for execution by using grid projections. For example, let's try to print Hello World only on the remote nodes. To do this, we get an instance of grid projection for remote nodes, and we just execute our job on this projection. Let's save and execute. In our local node, since it's excluded, we do not see Hello World. Let's check our remote nodes, and we do see Hello World printed on our remote nodes. GridGain also has other predefined grid projections and allows users to create custom ones as well. For example, to create our runnable on a random remote node, we simply create projection for random node from remote projection and execute. As expected, no output on our local node, but our first remote node was picked up as a random remote node, and so there is no output on our second one. For more information, you can visit our website or join us at Twitter.